So this is a curved climb on back rack. Uh, since I uh, towing the you know the trailer, uh, I I I, uh, I just don't have place to uh, you know actually hook up the back rack. And uh, I done many research. Look like this is the only choice I have. So uh, let's see how that works. Okay. So that's uh, Kurt 18013 module number. Uh, I uh, I read some reviews that say the you know this uh, clamp is really hard to put it down and it's quite dangerous. I don't know. I mean, let's find out. So. Uh, Little instruction manual and uh, little uh, straps to hold the bag. Uh -huh. Okay. So you will be open and then locked. Yeah, looks pretty simple. So, I'm gonna push again. Okay, push again. Oh, that's a fully unlocked. Wow. Actually, it's pretty easy. <laughs> huh. Yeah, definitely pretty easy. It's easier than I thought. So, and when you unlock, you just pull this. So, when you pull this, say, right here is still a locked right here that's that's will be prevent that that snap you know usually people talk about when you unlock this this it's big snap maybe you hurt on your arm or finger or something but uh since this is this is actually locked here i i don't think when you when you unlock this can actually have any uh, big snap right here let's see see it's just like that see because this is uh, this is locked right here if you want to unlock the here you have to push more you have to push more on this side i believe because right now there's nothing to do right here so this is can only lock down not unlock so you if you want to even unlock more, you definitely need to push on this side to unlock more. See? That's you can unlock more. So I don't Yeah, I don't I don't know why the people talking about this big snap will hurt on your finger or something. You look like a it just very little movement right here. So when you push down it just see this is the fourth lock. And then you you push this, go all the way down. So that's the fully locked. If you snap, snap right here, you snap right here, pretty strongly. I think this is a pretty good design. Right? <laughs> Interesting. So let's see if he can hold me. Yeah, he can hold me. See? Oh my God. Yeah, he definitely can hold me. Yeah, it's definitely strong enough. Good. Oh, another thing people talk about that, uh, you know, that space, that don't have enough space for three bags. Yeah, it's definitely not, <laughs> not enough space for three bags. You probably can put a two adult bag and one, uh, you know, kids bag, I guess. But uh, I, I only use a five tire. It's, yeah, definitely not enough for three bags. I can, I think I put two of five tire. It should be okay. I mean, one will be here. One is all the way out. It should be okay. Yeah. Yeah, not for three bags. Two bags. Yeah. Good. I'll put that strap on for two bags. The strap should be right here. 
Wow. That's pretty tough, actually. Hmm, <sighs> that's pretty tough. Okay. Okay, and then you hook up the back, you hook up another side. Yeah, I think I just put a four strap there to hook up two bags, not for three bags. Yeah, that's everything I need. Pretty good. Pretty good, definitely. Oh, I think uh, so. When you take off, think about when you when you uh, snap this up, and then you take it off. Since you have to unlock this one, so you have to unlock this one. So when you actually take that out, it's 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 really hard because you have to push on this side to fully unlock. Okay, so this can come out. Yeah. Okay. So we just got a campsite. You can see right here. Uh, I want to do a continued review of this Clermont uh, back rack. It clearly says there's no space for any bag, you know. <laughs> so basically you have to uh, probably have make a very longer receiver so in order to uh, actually use this Clermont bag. Uh, in order to use this uh, climb on uh, back rack. But I still found that this is uh, still useful because think about when you got on the place and you have to uh, put a back because right now the back on the back on the back of the trailer. So right now the back is put over here. Um, but when you get on the place, when you have to travel around, so basically you still need a back rack. And uh, this climb on one is very lightweight and uh, very easy to uh, carry. So I think this is still uh, useful because uh, think about whenever I take off the trailer, I still can use this uh, like a regular back rack instead of to carry you know regular back rack you have to swap your receiver i mean that's definitely more weight than this because it's a thing about this is a very light weight yeah 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 this is about this uh clamon back rack uh it's not really exactly like what i expect but at least i can still use it <laughs> So this is how it look when I put on a two of five tire bag. It's really tight. <laughs> you can see it's really tight. I cannot even put it in one direction. So there's no space if I put it in the one direction. I have to, you know, cross over. One go that way, one go another way. So in that way, so you can actually hook up. You can see right here. You can actually hook up. So otherwise, it's just not enough. Very tight. But anyway, it's, it definitely works. I mean, it definitely works. So after I use it for a couple of days, um, this is kind of my final opinion. You can see the those kind of rest. I mean, it doesn't really work well. Especially you see the the mountain bike. Usually the frame is bigger, right? Usually it's much bigger than the road bike, so it doesn't fit in there. And uh, and also those uh, those uh, straps, those straps. I mean, this is really hard to put on and take it out. So <laughs> so end up I did not really use them at all. See. I just use a, um, so they have a, you know, this tightening strap over here. So
so basically I just use that to uh, tie them together it's the same thing on this side so, so this, the, I use this strap to tie them together uh, yeah it, it works but uh, it definitely not perfect but at least you know like I said this is a super lightweight compared to any uh, backpack if you have because uh, the, 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 uh, the uh, you know they have less uh, weight from the receiver that you need to put in because this is just need to clamp on so the weight is perfect if you uh, just need to use something temporarily to uh, go around I think this is still works yeah that's my uh, final opinions. Thanks.